Oh, and like, you know me, I'm always yeah. so brutally honest. Mm-hmm. There was a lot of people like, oh, you better change that shade name. And I'm like, I never, <sighs> we, me and Shane never once thought to ever change it. Really? I'm like, mm, I'm sorry. That's just, that's our real friend. Really? Because you're our real friend. It's just, it's past YouTube and the internet and fuck all that. You but, weren't scared of people like, no. ca- like not. Because I've been put through so much mental abuse and hell. And I get it. Some of the things that we've done and said are horrific. Yeah. And, well, and, and sadly, um, you know, we have to deal with those for the outcome. And I'll forever be sorry for all the dumb shit I said. Same. You know what I mean? But um, that doesn't define us. Right. At, at all. So, you know, and, and why people are angry at you, girl. Should we dive in? Can we dive into this? Oh, my God. Because you... Like, but when you <clears throat> brought up the question and said the word transgender, mm-hmm. the whole internet shut down for the day. It was crazy. It was so brutal. It was crazy mm-hmm. how quick, like... People were just so vicious. Vicious. Without asking any questions. It was just immediate judgment, like vicious. Yeah. You know what I mean? Like dumb con, you're canceled, apologize. Like, so it was horrific. Yeah. And me and Shane get, maybe, I don't know, is it because we're older? Is it because we've been through more? Like, I don't know. I remember I called you on the phone. Mm-hmm. And you guys, I've never actually said this on camera before, actually ever. And I'm not ashamed or, or by it, but no one's ever asked me. So... I used to have thoughts of, am I transgender? Should I transition? Am I supposed to be a woman? Like I had so many thoughts in my head because I've always been really feminine. Mm-hmm. And I didn't understand that I could be a male and wear makeup and, and, and feminine clothes and not be a woman. Like I, I was confused. Right. Also when we, were, when we were our age, no one knew what that was hardly. No. Yeah. No one was talking about it. Yeah. My mom couldn't have that conversation. She didn't know what the fuck we were. You right. Know, like, hey, right. I might be. I'm, maybe I'm. A, I'm a woman. Like what? Right. Like, it, like you, know, you know what I mean? It was like people would call like you know oh, you're a cross dresser and I'm like uh, I'm just Jeffrey. Right. Like, I don't know. I, I like looking like this. I don't know what it is. So I was so confused mentally for years. Right. And I really thought about transitioning. And, and how I, old were you when you were thinking this? Like nineteen twenty. Wow. Yeah, you know what I mean? So I'm, I'm 34 yeah. now, and I'm really comfortable in my skin, and I know I'm supposed to be, like, this is who I am. But I was so confused and conflicted back then. So for you to to question yourself, why was there such an outrage? Yeah. Did people think you were trolling? Like, what? How, how was so. it being you? That's what I want to ask. Yeah. Like, <laughs> it's how like was it being it on you me. during all that? Yeah, I just think, I think that's the thing. Cause, because, because I have said my controversy has been for me trolling in the past, which yes. I get. I think at one point I said, I said, yeah, <laughs> exactly. You get it. But if you don't, if you're not like us then you don't get it, but like, yeah, I've obviously you say stuff. Like I said, I supported Trump. What? Four years ago. I didn't know anything about politics. Never voted in my life, but I was like, it'll get me views. It'll get me money. So because I yeah, trolled. He was a reality star. Right. No one ever thought he would actually be yeah. president. Oh, when I did it, he I, hadn't even got the nomination. And I was it, like, I support exactly. Trump. And it bites me my ass to this day. Me saying stuff like stuff that I don't even know about immigration, but I was just saying shit on my ass, which again, horrific. And I totally will always like take heat for that. But when you're younger, you say dumb shit for attention. Yes. And I think that's what people forget. Right. All I did was, was want and seek attention. Yeah. Oh, yeah. was, I would say the most vile shit. And now you're like, oh my God. In any way. What the hell were you thinking? Right. But it's always used today, like that's how we are. Like that's exactly. Who we are. Like, so that's not who I am at me all. Me questioning if if I was born in the right gender, which I've I've put together a compilation of videos where I've talked about this, like me wondering, like if I I've always said that, like I think I'm a boy, like I wish yeah. I had a penis, like stuff like that. And I just put that out, but because I had so many scandals and horrific things this year, I got canceled over not responding to someone's text. We're friends now, we're cool, but because. <laughs> because I didn't collab with someone. The fact that that was so public, yeah. <laughs> I can't. It was crazy. I and I was like, really? So they just reached forever. So this one, I got in trouble because I don't word things PC. Yes. And so in the video, I would talk about like how I was scared to say that I was transgender because so many guys will be like, oh, do you have a good dick? And like stuff so derogatory. And people yes. were so mad that I said that. But I get that all the time. And if you get that and it's your reality, why yeah. are you not allowed to say? Yeah. You know what I mean? Which like, is, I hear, I'm trying to think like the top five horrible things I hear every day. Even about my man, right? Like we're five years in, Nate's with you for the money. <laughs> we're on year five. Are, are five we years. ever going to stop saying he's gay for pay and degrade the person that's in love with me? They'll I never guess not. say it. They're but jealous. You have to, yeah, and you have to get over it. And, you know, I, yeah. I say that because it used to be very triggering for him. Like, oh my God, oh. I love you. Like, I don't care about any of this shit. When we met, Trisha, he didn't know what Louis Vuitton was. Right. <laughs> He's from what? Michigan. He's Michigan. Tiny town, population ten thousand. He's like, he, he thought Gucci was the rapper. <laughs> like I'm Aww. not. He thought, like, oh my, God, it's so endearing Aww. though. But you're like Ferragama. He's like, I don't know what that means. Yeah. <laughs> so it's like I you know, that. but people are just so quick to 
you know, just to, trying to attack to, you yeah, wherever way. Latch on you're things. happy and in love, so they're like, well, let's just try let's and bring try this to down. Tear it down. I don't know. Or like when me or when Shane didn't put the drama in, it's a cash grab. Ugh. So all, after a hundred hours of footage, seven episodes in, it's suddenly a cash grab because mm-hmm. we don't because Shane thought some of the drama was irrelevant <laughs> because it's been nine months. Yeah, like, which it, it is past, and also it wasn't about that at the end of it. Like, about yeah, that at all. It yeah. happened in the middle of filming, but it was about making and manufacturing cosmetics, and, and people were getting so vicious mm-hmm. to him. It was like almost making him not enjoy the success. Right. Oh, I'm I like, know. Y'all are trying to tear, tear this man down for some dumb tea that's so cold. Yeah. It's like down the garbage disposal. I know. And it was about you and him. <laughs> so to give other people any sort of, that had nothing to do with the palette, why no. even? Because it's so successful. So they could they could have like turned around and been like, well, it was attributed to because we had our drama in there. And so that's why. Exactly. But you guys yeah. didn't need it. You no. sold we out. Like, it. It was, yeah. It was, it was unreal. It was and beautiful. even during the drama, you... Everyone was like waiting for your response video and you were like, I'm just done. You were like, I'm not responding. What, okay, can I ask you, what did you actually think of that for real? Like me me responding with for the, I'm going to say maybe for the first time ever, mm-hmm. really adult, like, hey, you guys, we're not doing this anymore. Yeah. I don't care if you if you think I don't have any receipts or blah, blah, blah. Yeah. I don't care anymore. I loved it. I'm just going to pump the brakes because this is so toxic. We're all on CNN. Yeah. It's just getting really disgusting and it's turning so vicious. Yeah. And I hate that I involved myself, but it happened. It was, I lo- no, I love was, that you squashed it. Because honestly, that's where I'm trying to get. That was my level of like, anytime someone comes to me with like stuff that's going to trigger me, because I am an angry person for sure, and I can get triggered. But I love that because that's how mm. I feel now. I'm like, I'm finally happy yeah. in life that like when something comes to me, unless someone needs to be called yes. out, if they're like harassing me or something, like I will call them out. <laughs> but if it's drama, but like... How do we respond? And you have right. to respond different. Right. You know, so I, I put it all dead in the water and there was a lot of anger about that. Because they want you to be angry, Jeffrey. Yeah. And they wanted me to just expose it all. Blah, blah, blah. I'm just like. And keep adding fuel. I'm so tired of that. Like. And you're just at a, such a different place now even than you were when like we first met a couple yes. years ago. Like, I'm like, I just want to create makeup and, and like hustle and work. Yeah. Like, I don't want to be involved in the child shit. It really eats at you. Because as much as I love, like everyone thinks I just love drama and attention, but it's like it eats at you. And like, it's not good. It gives you anxiety because like, am I going to wake up with a lawsuit? Am I going to wake up with this? Like, it's just unwanted anxiety. Mm. Have you got, did you get any lawsuits this year? Um, yeah. About that? No, or just about, of course not about that. Oh, about something else. <laughs> because people love to say, like, I'm calling my lawyers and then no one ever does, you know? You know what, there's a conspiracy about our drama, um, about the beauty drama, uh-huh. that, that everyone called their lawyers and we had a huge round table meeting. Oh. And I'm like, that never happened. <laughs> I'm like, like, I know everyone wants to think that happened no. and it sounds cool like a TV show. No. I, I pulled the plug and I was like, yeah. I'm not doing this anymore. Cool. Like, let's stop.